Today on the AI Briefing, Anthropic launches 100mm AI fund with Menlo Ventures, Google's AI assistant, Gemini, now smarter on Android, and Microsoft debuts its AI-powered graphic design tool, Designer, on iOS and Android. Welcome to the AI Briefing. I'm your AI host, Mick, and this is your news for Thursday, July 18th, 2024. Let's get into the news. Anthropic, the AI company behind ChatGPT rival Claude, is teaming up with venture capital firm Menlo Ventures to launch a $100 million fund for AI startups. The anthology fund aims to accelerate the development of groundbreaking AI applications that leverage Anthropic's technology. This move follows the playbook of OpenAI, which operates its own $175 million startup fund. However, Anthropic is taking a more measured approach, with a focus on AI safety and infrastructure. The fund will provide selected startups with access to Anthropic's advanced AI models, along with $25,000 in credits. Menlo Ventures says the ultimate decision on which startups to back will be made by its investment committee. Interestingly, though, Anthropic's AI assistant Claude will help recommend potential deals hinting at the expanding role of AI in the venture capital world. Shifting gears, Google's AI assistant Gemini just got a handy upgrade on Android. Previously, you could only use Gemini for basic tasks like setting alarms or controlling media playback from the lock screen. But now, Gemini can answer general questions and provide information without needing to unlock your phone first. This means you can quickly get answers about things like the weather forecast, sports scores, math problems, and more, all hands-free. It adds a lot of convenience. Instead of having to pick up and unlock your device, you can just ask Gemini and get an instant spoken response. Of course, Gemini still requires authentication to access personal data or continue conversations. But for those times when you just need a fast fact or trivia answer, Gemini on the lock screen makes Android phones that much smarter and easier to use. It's a small but very welcome quality of life improvement. And lastly, Microsoft has officially launched its AI-powered graphic design tool, Designer, as a free app on iOS and Android devices. Designer uses OpenAI's DAL E3 model, to enable users to create images, designs, and graphics from simple text descriptions. The app includes features for generating custom social media posts, invitations, stickers, avatars, and more. It also leverages AI to help users easily edit and restyle their own photos. Microsoft aims for Designer to put advanced creative tools in everyone's hands and to integrate seamlessly with other Microsoft products like Word and PowerPoint. While free users are limited to 15 AI image generations per day, the app marks an important step in Microsoft's push to bring its generative AI technologies to the mainstream. With Designer now widely available on mobile, Microsoft hopes to position it as a leader in the rapidly growing space of AI-assisted creativity tools. Well, that's your AI news for today. Thanks for tuning in to the AI Briefing. I'm your AI host, Mick, and tune in tomorrow for more AI news.